Hey YouTube, I wanted to show you a really good piece of equipment that I've had for a while and I've done um, some modifications on it and I wanted to uh, show it to you and uh, it's this uh, mar Marbles Bolo Machete it's basically a, a Filipino style machete it's short but uh, it's relatively thick and heavy and uh, instead of like a normal Latin machete that comes to a point at the end like a cutlass this you know has this rounded edge so it's great for chopping you know it's like he you know has a heavy end so sort of like an axe and it's actually double sharpened like it's sharpened all the way up here so if you're you know using it for self defense you could you could come back up and uh, it's really great for the price I think it was around fifteen dollars including the sheath on Amazon I don't think you can really get anything that's much better than that I did a few modifications on it, like it came with uh, this orange sort of paint. Yeah, there, it's like bright orange. I didn't sand it off or anything, I just sanded it down a little bit, and then I painted it with this uh, coyote paint, and I think it makes it look a lot better. You know, and it's going to protect it, a little bit of extra paint so to uh, prevent it from rusting. And then I put a, <clears throat> I drilled a hole. And then I put a little uh, cop copper tube, copper little copper pipe in there, so I could uh, put a lanyard on it. And then I modified the handle. The handle was huge. It, it literally like was like that. And I sanded it down, made it into sort of like a tram, tramatonia machete style handle. And it took me a long time because I don't have any power tools, and I I just basically filed it, filed and filed and filed. And uh, it's kind of like rough, but it actually aids in, help, in helping me to uh, get a good grip on it. And then I kept this little ball so that when I swing it, that uh, it gives me something to hold on to. And it works quite well. It's a lot better than what it was before. And uh, next I'm going to mix up some of my silicon solution and paint it on there to protect it. And this is the sheath that it comes with. It's quite basic. And I have uh, a little... Um, sharpening tool in there. It's very light. And uh, that's it. I think it's a great survival tool. You know, like it combines a machete and an axe and a compact. It's a lot more compact than a normal machete. And uh, it's not too thin, not too thick, not too light, not too heavy. You know, and uh, like I said, for the price, I don't think you can uh, beat it. It's made in El Salvador. You know, so... Uh, that's like where, you know, Central and South America are pretty much where the best machetes come from. So I'd recommend you check it out. Thanks.